Hey guys, thanks for watching today's video. If you want to see more from us, make sure to subscribe to this YouTube channel. Well, this is kind of fun, kind of cool that I didn't know that the phone does this, but now my phone, Siri, actually tells you when you're crossing the state line and it gives you like a nice, hi, welcome to uh, Washington, D.C. And then a second later it said, Welcome to Washington, so, no, welcome to no. Maryland. <laughs> so, it's kind of cool, I just did the update on my phone, so I'm not sure it's because I updated my iPhone, that that's why now I have the welcome to Washington DC and the welcome to Maryland, but I think it's interesting that it kind of tells you when you're crossing the state line, doesn't you think? So, we made it, we're passing Washington DC right now because we're going to Maryland to visit some family, then we're gonna go to Baltimore to visit some other family, and then we are going back to Washington DC, they're all very close to each other, so we're just gonna spend the next few days in this area. So, we'll take you along, as always. Make sure to follow our social media accounts where we'll be posting more content related to this YouTube channel. Right now we are headed to downtown Annapolis. It's about 15 minutes from where we're staying in a local Maryland Annapolis neighborhood, which was really, really nice, great experience. And the downtown is very historic. It's got a port there, so lots of boats. People keep their boats, a lot of sailboats. I think the north is kind of famous for having a lot of sailboats versus the south. Like in South Florida, where I'm from, we have a lot of speed boats and yachts and those kind of things. They have those up here too, but I think sailboats is kind of the idea when you think of the north east of uh, United States. You can go down to the downtown Annapolis and just kind of hang out. There's a lot of outdoor seating, so you can actually just walk around. You could grab a drink, grab a bite to eat with friends or family, and just spend a nice day there. So excited to check it out. So right now we're actually walking around the Capitol building 
here in the city of Annapolis. Annapolis is the capital of Maryland and this city actually is very historic because it used to be the whole capital of the United States before Washington DC became the capital of the US. So far, my quick review of Annapolis is that it's really beautiful, whether you're downtown or you're just in the neighborhood. The town itself is very beautiful, seems very safe. I definitely recommend coming here. It's very historic, which I was surprised about. I didn't know that. Uh, so I am definitely can recommend taking a visit here. Staying in the downtown is really nice and it's a great walking city to explore by foot.
We have a tourist in his element, yeah. first time in Maryland. So here is the very prestigious St. John's College. And that is a private university. Very pretty, very peaceful around here. you enjoyed this video if you did enjoy this video make sure you hit that thumbs up like button down below and thanks so much for doing that in advance also if you have any questions or comments make sure you leave those down below in the comment section if you have any suggestions for future videos that you'd like to see leave those as well in a comment down below I'll get to those as soon as I can don't forget to share this video on social media with friends